Well, it did that on the Amstrad version anyway. And hello today. And today we're going to have a game of duet on the Sinclair ZX Spectrum. And the reason why I knew that did, it did that on the Amstrad, because I used to own this on the Amstrad. Um, it was part of the six pack um game compilation and this game was a bonus game on that compilation pack actually it had seven games on it it was called six pack yeah i remember that compilation pack pretty well it had some good games on it um so looking at this it is exactly the same as the Amstrad cpc version so it makes me think that the spectrum version got ported to the Amstrad CPC because the I've had a test run of this the Amstrad CPC version runs so much slower um, but it's the same game but the only difference is the Spectrum version has sound effects where the Amstrad CPC version had some really decent music playing all the way through the game and the title menu hence when I went done that little tune um, Right, so let's play the game. First of all, we're going to refund our keys and to the good old QAOP spacebar, not M, that it seems like every Spectrum user used back in the day because um, the Spectrum 48K rubber key didn't have a spacebar. It had a break, was it a break space it had? So I had an Amstrad TPC and I used QAOP and space. Right, a ball, I don't know, let's push that. And hold. Oh, I might push enter. So let's play the game. Push space bar. So what we got to do is um, might be a little bit like Commando. I think this is also known as Commando 86 or Commando 87. Um, yeah, I didn't know that. I always known it, known it to be duet. Oh, shouldn't shot that. Whatever it is. Yeah. It's exactly, it was ported, oh look at that speed, yeah it was ported to the Amstrad CPC, it was exactly the same version, except for this version runs much faster. Right, so you need the snips to, um, right, so in these, right, as I explained, you need the snips to cut through the wires, and what you've got to do is find the exit. And for, bo for a bonus, you, you can find documents. That's what you're really supposed to do, is find the documents. And to find the documents, they're in these bags. So you shoot it, there's no document, as it's going to say at the bottom there. Yeah, so it reminds me a little bit like Commando and Gauntlet. So that's a shield. So I'll get a little bit of in in invincibility there. So I've not found, found, right, there's the exit. I think that could be the document. Yep, there's the document. I found the document, so you collect the document. So that's level one done. Um, Where am I? So this is a, a gripe with this game. Because um, it's monochromic, all the soldiers look the same, including the soldier you're controlling. Sometimes it can get a bit confusing where you are. So that's the invincibility out. No document. Oh, there's a piece of cake there. That'll give you health points. Right, here we go. Yep, I found the document. So, I haven't, oh, I did have a snip. So I found the document. So all I need to do is find the exit. Watch that thing, because if you touch that, your health starts going down. I think they could be, um, oh no. Oh, so if you blow that, that's a grenade, you should blow that up. It blows everything up in sight of the screen. Well, all the soldiers that is, that's power pills. So that makes you go faster. Oh, let's chop the food. Shit. Right, so there's the snips. Let's get the other snips because they're always coming handy. 
If you're thinking about having a vasectomy, that is. No, I'm joking. Right, let's go through here. More snips. Get the snips. Don't need. Ah, there's the exit. Right, let's go. So, level three. All of those power pills up there. Right, snips. Right. Yeah, it seems to be, you know, it's, it, I have to say, it, because the Spectrum version's faster, it is a little bit, it is better to play. But it does lack, it does lack that music. Because that music on the Amstrad CPC was amazing. Yes, and this version lacks that music. But there was no sound effects on the CPC version, just the music. See, this is the 48k. I think this is a 40k game only, so don't know if there was a 1 to 8k version. Maybe it would have had that music, but I don't know. I, I didn't look properly either to see. Oh, game over. So I've run out of. I've run out of. Um, run out of energy. Okay, so at least I'm top of the table there. Look at that at the bottom there. J M Jar Jean Michel Jar. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. Um, I do prefer the Spectrum version over the CPC version because it's running a lot quicker. Um, but you know, it has the same faults. Like everything's monochromic. It's hard to um, tell your soldier from the enemy soldiers. Um, they could have maybe had. I don't know. Add it a different colour at least, just your main soldiers, you can tell what one you're controlling. But it's alright the game, the game is okay to play. Um, uh, if you like your run and gun, shoot em ups, maybe give this one a try if you haven't already. Um, it's worth having a go. But you know, it's not like Commando, it is, you know, you've got to um, fight option always to find the document and find the exit you got to combine it with a little bit like um, gauntlet and I do believe you can have up to two players on this game I think you can have up to two players but once again you're gonna have the same problem of identifying your soldier anyway I'm gonna end this now thank you so much for watching till next time and goodbye